Big news from Hollywood. Late night shows and Saturday Night Live are going dark and will air reruns after writers went on strike for the first time in 15 years. Film and TV production shut down after the Writers Guild of America failed to reach an agreement with studios. CBS's Elise Preston reports from Los Angeles. They've put down their pens. Our story! And picked up picket signs. We're going to keep striking until we get what we want. For viewers, the impact is immediate. Late night shows are now dark. Last night, comedian Stephen Colbert struck a more serious tone. These are our writers, and I'll stick myself in there because I'm WGA2, and they're so important to our show. I also think that the writers' demands are not unreasonable. Daytime soaps could be the next casualty. Let her die. This could be just the start of the script. Actors and directors are facing their own labor uncertainty. Both of those guilds are about to negotiate. We could have an entire town uh, out on the picket line at some point. Writers gotta get What's playing out on the streets in front of studios on both coasts is a real life drama. The writers see themselves as being left behind and they see themselves as being um, increasingly marginalized in an entertainment economy that is only benefiting the top 1%. Now adding to their outrage, executive pay, the salaries of many top studio execs have been released publicly to their shareholders. They reveal several entertainment CEOs made more than $30 million in pay last year. Nora? Elise Preston, thank you very much.